Okay guys, today we're going to be showing our garden. We're about a month later than we normally are with planting things. And my hair is a frizzball, but whatever, who cares? I'm in the outsides in the garden parts, it doesn't matter. But before we actually get started with planting, I'm gonna show you what Jeff has done so far. And yes, Jeff did it all himself while I was doing other things. Um, but I'm just going to play that with, a, uh, I'm going to share that with some music. I get lost inside my thoughts and when I start to think Oh, the time, how close it starts to end up on the brink I tried so hard but all these scars, they cut so deep I bleed I fell so fast from heaven It's like someone clipped my wings Now I'm falling And I can't see the ground Can we stop this gravity? It keeps bringing me down Right here in the middle ground 
Okay, so now I'm gonna go down here and since you've seen all of the work up to this point, I'm gonna show you the herbs from last year that I thought all of them had died. And actually we didn't get, do we get any herbs out of this last year? I think I got some oregano. But all the rest of it, and I got some parsley out of it. But all the rest of it I thought just died because of all the rain we were getting and all that stuff and yes you're probably gonna hear chad a lot because he's super loud all the time so um this is the time that i planted last year this is the sage that i planted last year the parsley it's the curled parsley and this is the oregano and actually i should have probably had just one spot just for oregano because it just goes everywhere it just kind of takes over everything it's even hold on you put all them tools right i don't like the way those are and you knew that <laughs> it's even growing out the side jeff has a very bad habit of turning tools like blade side up i don't like that it's it's a mess but anyway we're gonna get to planting our garden this morning before the sun gets out there and, and makes it even hotter. Because I don't know what temperature it is. It's like 7 in the morning. Which is not super early, but it's not super late either. And it's already 76 from what this says. Yeah, 76 already at 7.30. So... I'm going to let him set up the camera. He's been doing it every time, so he knows which angle he wants to get it at. I can't wait to leave this town Cause lately I've been feeling down The cold nights just don't feel the same Oh, 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 oh. Back my life inside a car
lately I've been feeling down Okay, so what we've planted are jalapenos, big boy hybrid tomatoes, uh, also some tomatoes that Jeff had, I showed it on another video, he had cut a tomato to eat and it had seeds that were sprouting, so he just sliced it up and threw it out beside the house. Not threw it out, but planted it or buried it beside the house. So we planted those. I can't remember what kind of tomato that was. Um, so we're just trying that out, see if it works. We let them grow and separated them. Um, got some banana peppers, some onion, white Lisbon bunching. I've never grown onion before, Jeff has. And some cucumbers. Um, is that all we've done so far? Is that all we did? Oh, and then um, some bell peppers that are multicolor. I don't know what colors each one of the plants are. Could be all the same, who knows? Um, and we also have some potatoes we wanna do, but I don't know how we're gonna do those. We'll see. So the garden is planted. Now we gotta put the fence back up so the dogs won't get out in it and dig and act crazy because we have one that would absolutely do that. And um, water it and we'll be done for the day. And then I'll start giving y'all some updates as the, it grows and as I see the seeds hopefully grow. I'm, I don't, have we ever planted anything from seed out here? Okra. Yeah, okra and some peas. That's the only things we've ever done, or beans and peas, that we've ever planted from seed here. And this soil is the worst soil we've ever had um, we've been married almost 26 years and we planted a garden almost every time, every year, which we've been together longer than that and had gardens longer than that with each other. But um, this is the worst soil. We, we, there's things that we can't even grow here that we used to grow all the time. So I gotta go help him with the fence. And I guess I need to put these, are we gonna put these in the ground? The little stakes to tell what they are? Yeah, okay. Okay, so we have two rows of the jalapenos. There's four here and five here. That over there is super hard dirt. But why is it so hard there? It never was before, was it? Roots and stuff, okay. And then these two are the better boys. Um, there's six of those. There's mosquitoes trying to eat us. This is that where that the, the experiment tomatoes these are the four multicolor. We don't know which color is which. It could be all the same. Um, bell peppers. This is the banana peppers. Can't see it. <laughs> the onions and then cucumber down here. So, and this is the hot sweaty. And it took no time to get that done. But other than watering it, that's all we're doing today. And I'm not gonna show y'all why it's watering it. 
if it was going to rain today, I wouldn't worry about it. But, yeah, Saturday's not today. But anyway, um, he's just putting in some little things to hold the fence down. And this is not going to keep much out, but our dogs won't go in there. We actually have one dog that could climb that chain link fence over there. She would just climb up over it, but she, it, it stops her. She doesn't have a desire to. Um, but yeah, that's our garden started. And let's just hope it grows and we have pretty good harvest from it. Um, living in a city, we have a much smaller space, a much smaller garden than what we used to have. We used to have one, what, about three or four times this size? What? <laughs> Way more than that. Well, I mean, I don't know. I, I'm not good with judging sizes. So how much bigger was it that, that you... Huh? He said it was probably about 75 yards long. That's as far as he's gotten. He actually just got off work. He's been at work all night. But we wanted to get this done this morning before he goes to bed. And I was awake until probably about almost three because I just don't sleep when he's on the shift. So anyways, um, there'd probably be a nap in my future today though. I usually don't get up until after a while whenever he's on the shift. So that is all that I have for today to share with you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. There will start being um, garden updates. I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it. If I'm just going to throw them in with another video. Um, or if it's going to be one right by itself like it used to be. I'll decide whenever the time gets here for me to start. But I probably won't start updating until next well, a couple weeks. I don't know. It may be next week. We'll see. Thank you guys for coming along with us on our little journey here of this crazy veal that we live in. And coming along with all the stuff we do on our little urban homestead, I guess is what it is. It's definitely urban. It's definitely in the middle of the city. He's watering the plants, this is. And he's using just regular water, like regular water. What is regular water? He's using city water because he does, we don't have the rain catchment system hooked up right now. So, it's okay. It's the, what we're doing. But yeah, we're definitely um, in an urban area where there's lots of houses and very small yards. And um, at least we don't have an HOA, though. Who <laughs> will tell us we can't have chickens and stuff. So, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for hanging out with us. And remember, don't take any wooden nickels. And be sweet.